welcome back to the ms excel part 2 classes we have studied that microsoft excel is an electronic spreadsheet program which is used to organize data into rows and columns and to perform mathematical calculations quickly and to analyze and manage data in an easier manner we will see how the formulas and functions are being working in excel uh, such things we are going to see formulas the ba the basic way to add two cells we have studied in the last class is by using uh, the mathematical operator plus and here c3 plus c4 is being added and the result appears in f3 likewise you could subtract it multiply it and divide it all this you could do uh, do it by yourself the mathematical operator plus is used for addition subtraction multiplication is by star sign and division by hash and uh, the exponential sign of the power up sign is the up arrow key and here you could go introduction to functions we have seen in the last class about the how to sum up uh, the various things that appear in various columns here the functions gives you the ability to do a variety of things like performing mathematical operators look up the value or even calculate dates and time let us try a few ways to add up values with the function sum under the amount column or for fruits uh, cell d7 end equal to sum bracket or the parenthesis d3 starting from d3 and the range double dots and d6 close the uh, parenthesis that is the range is from d3 to d6 and it gets summed up or auto sum it is called okay there are keyboard shortcuts also alt plus equal to is the keyboard shortcut and more about functions the functions have many uh, the function name the first argument uh, the second uh, the last argument and the additional arguments you could give just for the time being study about the simple ways to keep uh, the sum function working and we will think about the average use the average function to get the average of numbers in a range of cells uh, for example apple is having uh, the price of 50 oranges 20 and bananas 60 and lemons 40 what is average price that means the average price we have to get the select the amount all the amounts that is from uh, 50 to 40 that must be the range and you have to uh, uh, here look a v e r a g e is being used uh, a function or a formula always starts with an equal to sign and uh, uh, here you are going to put the uh, equal to sign average bracket on g3 to g6 uh, in the last class we were doing all these uh, 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 functions uh, the maximum function is there the minimum function is there and so on uh, and I just want to show you another example where the sales of the Britannia products uh, this is the manner in which uh, uh, the the sales department or the uh, the sales executive keeps the price uh, here it is uh, shown that the carton price is here and the unit price are there the lit what is a carton a carton means a box not packets this is a box which contains a lot of packets is called a carton okay uh, little hearts is having a price a carton is having a price of 910 rupees and the unit sold in the northern area is 456 and the eastern area is 346 and the western area is 569 and the southern area is 418 
we need to find the sales amount the sales amount means you have to multiply the carton price with the unit price the carton price of the cell is not being changing but the units in the northeast west and south will be changing so always use the constant price in the of little hearts placed in c5 so that you are, there is a constant value and you have to multiply that with the respective units in north east west and south so you will get the sales amount in the respective columns of e5 g5 i5 and k5 and those figures which you get in e5 g5 and uh, uh, i5 and uh, uh, K5 need to be summed up to get the total sales. That is why the North, East, West, South divide the little hearts in the Britannia products. We have to sell the little hearts in the Britannia Little hearts in northern area 456 units are sell out. That is the price. Of what, how will you do it? We will put the uh, uh, product equal to uh, the cell address uh, C, C5 into that means star plus D5 and press enter key you will get the amount and when you drag it you will get the uh, respective columns here and here you have to put it in such a manner that uh, it is uh, again c5 into equal to equal to c5 into f5 and drag it down and here you have to find the answer uh, it is carton price of sales amount uh, uh, c5 equal to c5 into into h5 enter key will get the answer you have to drag it down and uh, equal to equal to c5 into j5 enter and drag it down and now you need to sum the total and uh, to summing up the total unit equal to you have to give a uh, formula manually plus 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 and here plus and the key and you have to drag it down and the rest here comes the questions which you do have write a formula in e5 to find the total size of little hearts in northern territory and everything i have uh, given um, now you have in this certain uh, questions are not being answered you need to find the answers for that okay look into the uh, sheet find the answers and then uh, try to solve by yourself first create the sheet by yourself then try to answer these questions and if you are able to answer you will be a uh, you are in a position to know the basic functions just like sum average count maximum minimum and so on these things you will be able to do it i am not elaborating uh, we will do the same exercise in the class uh, after uh, your turn when you are able to do it by yourselves uh, at home then we will uh, uh, try to do it and then we will discuss about it uh, we are back to the uh, formulas and functions the minima and maximum functions are here and uh, welcome to exact numbers like a champ fill of the fill button it is being explained here look here click the fill 
a cell with the number 100 and then rest your cursor on the lower right corner of the cell until it becomes a cross i have shown you in the class how to i have shown you in the class how to uh, fill uh, using auto fill button or oh, this is the filling right filling down etc uh, the the save time by filling cells automatically that means the here uh, the auto fund auto fill button helps you to fill uh, many of the uh, uh, many of the formulas and functions to the next cell automatically uh, Look here, you can fill January, February, March, etc. Weeks 1, week 1, week 2, etc. And uh, the split cell is here. Split a column based on de uh, delimiters. Flash fill is pretty handy, but if you have, want to split data into more than one column at a, uh, at all at once, then it is not the best tool for the job. Try next to columns okay here we are going to get the first name and the last name and the uh, company name etc and uh, you under delimiters make sure the comma is the only checkbox selected and uh, then click next Looky, look here in the data, Nancy is the first name, Smith is the second name and Kondozo uh, uh, is the company name. Uh, you need to uh, uh, work with it. Uh, you could study Excel online also. In the online, you will get a number of uh, uh, online tutors are there. You might want to write a formula to split the data, and this, and in this way, uh, it will be working. We will go and see how to have a few tips and. click inside the data below and then on the insert tab click recommended charts so that the chart appears i have shown you uh, you can click here for the uh, the fill button if your data is imported and refreshed, flash fill will auto won't automatically clean it up. Okay. Um, upload an Excel file to OneDrive.com so that I share it, and then everyone can edit the file at the same time using a web browser. Look here. This is one of the latest features. The one of the latest features is uh, to upload a, an Excel file to OneDrive.com so that OneDrive is a cloud computing app and uh, in that you will be able to um, the many people will be able to edit the sheet at the same time. Okay. Uh, these are the features which you we do have uh, in MS Excel and you need to uh, for the time being you need to uh, solve the, these questions the 10 questions you do have in the Britannia products uh, okay this is your uh, problem and uh, uh, I have solved it one ac to one extent. You have to do it by yourself. Uh, first, create the sheet blank. Then try to get the answers with the uh, with the formulas, and uh, make the sheets of yourself. And here are the ways in which you have to write the functions. 
Uh, write a function in G11 to find the total sales amount of Tiger Glucose in the Eastern Territory. Okay, I have done it. But uh, a function and formula is a very important experiment. You have to do uh, the exercise by yourself so that you will be uh, you will be able to solve such uh, such streets in the future near future uh, thank you for being with me and hope everybody